going off of side to side, I probably would have said the same thing. I probably would have said, why the f***? <laughs> kill kill oh me. God. I've waited 20 years for this. Kill, kill me. Ariana Grande is responding to fan criticism over her wicked casting. The 31-year-old is opening up about her history with the hit Broadway musical and her passion for playing Glinda in the film adaptation, opposite Cynthia Erivo in the role of Elphaba. Ariana says this on the November 1st episode of the Sentimental Men podcast. And this is something that I, I loved about auditioning so much for, for Wicked was that, like, it has to be earned. Anything, mm -hmm. as, you know, on this scale being a part of anything i think isn't it's not just like given because they know you for one thing so it's fun right. to kind of have the challenge of reframing people's perception and kind of like doing the work to earn your way back into the other spaces it's funny because mm -hmm. people sometimes say that to me they're like you had to audition i'm like F yeah I had to of course hey. what are you out of your board yeah. it's yeah. it's wicked and it requires right. a totally different skill set than people know me for and have ever seen me do anything like and of course, it's wicked. That's the most respectful thing. You have to do, it has to be earned, period. Right. <laughs> Ariana adds that she understands why Wicked fans may not have initially welcomed the casting news. You know, I think of course, like any human being caring something about something they care so much about like that, you know, this it's been a great secret. You know, they didn't get to see any auditions or know anything. So. Yeah. You know, going off of side to side, I probably would have said the same thing. I probably would have said, why the f***? <laughs> kill kill oh me. God. I've waited 20 years for this. Kill kill me. I've waited. Yeah, you know, like I was I would have said that as a as a fan from the outside, knowing of only of only seven rings, probably I'd say, well, that's f so, you mm -hmm. know, I, I get it. But I think that initially in the beginning, I was like, OK, I'm going to try to turn that off and just do the work, keep my blinders on and 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 focus and train and do my, do the best I can. The Grammy winner also admits to being anxious about living up to expectations. I felt um, a little bit of the um, initial nervousness or the sort of preconceived notions about what I might be able to deliver or not deliver or why mm -hmm. I would be wrong or whatever. The singer adds that though some might perceive her stardom as an advantage, she felt otherwise. I think that's kind of, I think it was the opposite. I think it was, it, it can work against me, you know, mm -hmm. in certain, in certain ways, because, you know, when, when you have this caricaturized persona that's out there and people yeah. know you very well as this one thing, it's like, how you know is this person going to be able to erase that and disappear into a mm -hmm. character that we need them to to offer themselves to this greater story you know mm -hmm. and uh, mm -hmm. it's not that it's not about them this isn't about right. me wicked hits theaters on november 22nd